gonna start off priming my eyes. I, I'm gonna be using this Glad Girl Eyeshadow Prep on Prime. I'm just gonna be applying these all over my eyes. And this is the first time that I'm actually gonna be using this product. And you guys, I always like to start with my eyes because I'm really messy when I'm working with eyeshadows. So this primer is vegan, cruelty-free, and this company has great prices. Um, to be honest, this primer doesn't have a lot of coverage. And for my personal preference, I always like to use something that cover my veins. And right now it's like not covering my veins at all, but let's see how it works. All right, now for my transition color, I'm gonna be using this eyeshadow from Make A Geek. This one is creme brulee, and I'm gonna be applying the color all over my crease using a fluffy brush from Sigma. This one is the E35, and I'm just gonna be um, applying this on my crease. In wiper motions, and I'm gonna be extending the color outwards. And then I'm gonna concentrate the rest of the product in the inner corner of the eye towards the brow. Now I'm gonna go in with this Naked Cosmetics eyeshadow palette. I received this in my BoxyCharm this, in this month. And I'm just gonna be picking up this shade in the center, which is so pretty. Before, I'm gonna be spraying a little bit of this Primer Mist from e.l.f. And by doing this, I'm just gonna be intensifying the color even more and making it more um, metallic. And right after, I'm gonna be taking some more of the same color, blending this up to the crease. I want this color basically all over my eyes. And you know the drill, I always like to flip the eyeshadow outwards just to lift my eyes. Then I'm gonna be taking the E35 again and I'm just and I'm just gonna try to fade out the upper crease. Then I'm gonna take any brush with no product and I'm just gonna blend some more. <laughs> blend is key guys. You must blend. All right, now for my brow bone, I'm gonna be using another eyeshadow from Make A Gig. This one is Mirage. And I'm just gonna be applying these down my brows and then I'm gonna take any clean brush and I'm just gonna um, blend everything all right so now I'm just gonna be taking a little bit of concealer or foundation and I'm just gonna be cleaning out the edge of the eyes and I'm gonna be using my LA girl pro conceal and you can use a makeup remover whatever you want to use but today I'm lazy and to be honest, I don't know where is my, where are my makeup removers? I'm just gonna. All right, and now I'm just gonna be curling my lashes. I'm gonna be applying mascara to prep my lashes for the falsies. So I'm just gonna curl my lashes really quick. <laughs> just one coat. Oh shit. Oh. Thank you. Why that happens always, guys. So I'm not gonna get crazy. I'm not gonna clean that right now. I'm just gonna let it dry. Let it be until it's dry, and then I'm just gonna come back and remove it with a brush. For my lashes, I'm gonna be using these Elegance lashes. These are in the style Moonlight. And to be honest, guys, these lashes has become my favorite lashes ever. <laughs> you need to try them. They are so freaking gorgeous. All right, so now for my face, I'm gonna be using this Smashbox Photo Finish Foundation Primer. I'm just gonna be applying this with my hands all over my face. Ooh, it feels silky. To be honest, I don't know if I like it or if I'm not. So I will let you know later. All right, so for my foundation, I'm gonna be mixing two. This is something that I always do for some reason. I love to do conjunctions. So I'm gonna be using my Bodiography Oil-Free Natural Finish Foundation and with the Milani Council and Perfect 2-in-1. And I'm just gonna be applying these all over my face. All 
Right, so for my concealer, I'm gonna be using this LA Girl Pro Conceal. This one is in the shade Natural. And I'm just gonna be applying this down the eyes. And then I'm gonna take the damp sponge again and I'm just gonna be blending everything in. And now I'm gonna be setting everything in place with my Earth Spoon Translucent Powder. Oh, ladies, I really love this one. I'm just gonna be applying this on the eyes. The only part that I have been baking is my nose because that helps when I'm gonna go and blend the contour in my nose. And then to set the rest of my face, I'm gonna be using this NYC Smooth Powder. And I'm just gonna be dusting this all over my face using my Real Techniques powder brush. All right, now for my bronzer, I'm gonna be using this e.l.f. bronzer palette. I'm gonna pick up this shade right here and I'm just gonna be bronzing and contouring with For my blush, I'm gonna be using this Wet n Wild Fergie Center State Collection blush. This one is in Rose Golden Goddess, and I'm just gonna be applying this all over the apples of my cheeks. Now for my highlighter, I'm gonna be using this Vintage Illuminating Face Highlighter Set. I'm gonna be applying this color all over the high points of my face. All right, so going back to the Naked palette, I'm gonna be taking the same color. I'm gonna be running this on my bottom lash line. Then I'm gonna be lining my waterline with this Rimmel London Nude Liner. And now I'm gonna take this brown shade from Make A Geek. This one is Mocha. And with a angle brush, I'm just gonna be defining my lash line. Now for my inner corners, I'm gonna be using this pigment from Podiography. This one is in the shade Sparkler. And now for my lips, I'm gonna be lining them with this lip liner from Real Hair in the shade I Am Stoppable. And then I'm gonna be using this liquid lipstick from the same brand on top. And to finalize this look, I'm gonna be using a little bit of this e.l.f. Aqua Primer Mist. This is just gonna set everything in place and if something is a little bit powdery, this is just gonna make it like real skin. And this is the complete look. I really hope that you guys enjoy. Thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to give it a big thumbs up and subscribe if you love this look. If you wanna keep in touch with me every single time that I upload a video, you can click the notification bell to get notified every single time that I upload a new video. So I will see you very soon. I love you guys.